welcome back to Let's Talk World here at Chanclas Cantina here by Thunderbird Hotel. We are here at the Las Vegas Strip. They serve a lot of drinks. My favorite margarita. Cheers. And uh, they already uh, started their kitchen since last week. So guess what? You guys can come here, eat, drink, and have fun. And if you have a chance, you can be my next guest, like the one I have today, Mr. Manny C. Welcome, Mr. Manny C. Thank you for having me. And as you can see earlier, I actually put the, the products before I, I, I introduce him to you guys. He is the CEO and founder. How do you call yourself? Yeah, CEO, founder of Power X Drink. So, tell us more a little bit about your Power X Drink. Um, it's just a healthier alternative, you know, for energy drink. Uh -huh. you know, the other energy drinks out there, you know, they're kind of bad. I don't like to talk bad about any other brand. Yes. But um, as far as comparison goes, yeah, the ingredients are not yeah. that healthier than what we think. But if you look on this energy drink, you're kind of like, what? That's all they have in there? Yes, it's true. I wish, you know, I wish we have one today. I could have asked I have you. A bunch of, I have a bunch of coming. You didn't say the green, so I didn't know where to walk in. I know, I know. But so, but, yeah, but we, we can put it out there. Okay. So, yeah, this is the Power X drinks. How long you have been this company, uh, Manny? Um, well, just with Power X, we've been in the, you know, game now three years. We just started you know, from ground, you know, up again. So, we, you know, making labels, making a formula, everything took about a good year. We have the product now about two years. Two years, yeah. So, um, you started Power X Drink. What made you started, uh, doing, uh, you know, putting this out? Well, you know, I know the, the kids these days are drinking the energy. Uh -huh. You know, so we got to make something that's going to be better for them. You know, because they're going to drink. So why why do that to the youth? You know, everybody else is so out here, all the corporations, so quick to make a buck. You know, hey, if you can save money, I would put it in there, man. Who cares? Give it to them. You know, and they will. They don't think twice, you know, but me, I want to take that other end, the wrong way around, which I consider the right way around, you know, because if we don't take care of the youth and what's coming up, you know, now, you know, that's why we're in the York, corporate America. Are you a big uh, drinker of uh, power drink, uh, energy drink? Um, I wasn't before I started it, uh -huh. but I'll drink mine. It's good. Yeah, okay, you know? yeah, yeah but, it's um, good. He actually brings a lot of boxes in my studio and everybody who's coming in and like, they're drinking it. We have a lot of testimony about the Power X drink actually. Right. Yeah, I know. And um, you guys are listening out there, go to Yelp. I have a Yelp now and I, they say that helps. So that's what I'm trying right now too, just to get out there again. And I gotta rebrand it yes. and get it out there. But like I said, the product does you know, work for itself. Once you taste it, you know, hey, Hey. And it look, you know, you you can uh, draw into it once you see it. It's beautiful, as you can see the the uh, cans actually is like it's blue. Come on, there you go. Just looking at it is just like you're thirsty. You wanna drink it. But anyways, you are the founder and uh, the owner of Power X Drink. But you do different things. But before I go to that question. Uh, I believe that you guys are recreating or creating new product lines with um, Power X Drink. Yes, we are. We're looking into that right now. So as time goes, you know, we're going to do it. The main thing we're pushing right now is, is, is a, it's a healthy alternative energy. And after that, you know, we have other plans coming out. I don't want to say it out. Know, not, yeah, not yet. Not yet. Okay. Not yet. But yeah, but they, yeah it's on the they're line. creating yeah different product lines with Power X Drink. So you know, if you guys want to try it. Go ahead and try it. Come to my studio. It's only dollar dollar fifty. <laughs> but you know, let me let me tell you something. I'm not doing it by myself. Oh, I, have, okay. I have two great partners. Uh -huh. Actually, three. You know, one of them more fine. One he has his own company. The one he has his thing too. But um, big shout out there to Mark London. You know, that's that's my CEO and CFO Stuart Talbert over in Australia. And uh, we got Adrian Morales out there on the. Uh, the war in California. And those three, I wouldn't so be where I'm at without those three. You know? So not, not the Texas person. You have uh, one partner in Texas? Um, not Texas. Oh, no, not Texas. they're all in LA. One's in LA, two are in LA, uh -huh. and the other one's um, in Australia. Australia. So uh, you are planning to get this like internationally? Well, it's going to go global. global we're not, we're yeah. not trying to build just a little company yeah, here. Yeah, not, not only know? here. Right? No, no, we, we want to spread this everywhere. 
you know, because I think once once you break that door, uh -huh. the corporation, once you break that door where you do the right thing and start doing the good things again you can do with the money you make, yeah. um, I think it follows. Yeah. People start following. Yeah. You know what I mean? So that's why I hope you And you, have, you believe in product placement. You are and, a high believer. Oh, yeah, I mean, because, well, if the vibe's good and the feeling's good, you do it. You know, because that's when energy just meets and it goes. Yeah, I just uh, I don't know if you guys see a lot of uh, my shows here at social media shows. We keep on running those uh, commercials uh, with Power X Drink, and also if you come to my studio, you see that big Power X Drink right there. So yeah, we are, we we totally believe on this product because it's literally like my even my son who is. You know, he is a bodybuilder, right, right. not not really a professional bodybuilder, right, but, but and he was like, "Mom, I'm gonna drink all that boxes that man is brought." I said, "No, <laughs> this is to actually promote the product." He said, "Okay, just give me one box." <laughs> so he drank the, the whole box, and uh, you know, I, I kept the rest. But anyways, Manny, uh, you're you just moved to Vegas. Right, just so how's Vegas um, treating um, you so far? Vegas is different from LA. You know, they both have yeah. good nightlife, good thing. But Vegas doesn't stop. Vegas goes anytime you're ready. To so go, are you tired now? You've been um, you've been here, he's been here for a month, and I think he's tired now. No, I, I think my sleeping habits kind of changed. You know, because nighttime I can get things done too because you know everyone's doing it and it's quiet a little bit. In daytime, you know, I'm just it's hot out there. I just want to just chill. And, so nighttime, I'm up like late. You know, sometimes I'll be patching myself on the computer. Yeah, I gotta get to bed. That sun's coming up. You know, and I see it. I, oh no, I gotta get to bed. And you go to bed, but that's what's great, great about things. You can that's do it passion, you want, guys. You that's want. passion. You can see that. You can see his passion because I remember when I'm building social media shows three years ago. I don't sleep. I was like, oh my god, the sun is coming up. Right, I gotta have right, to bed. Right. Go to bed. But I'm so lucky enough to have hired different people who is actually my support system now. And, um, you know, I'm the boss that doesn't know how to yell because you know what, when you yell at your employer, then you just, uh, but, but that's how uh, working, I'm working now with uh, more sleep and they always uh, bring me food. Where's my food? Just kidding. But they, I know, he, he got me this though. But we're gonna eat here uh, at 5 p.m. I'm trying to actually extend this show so that we can have some food. <laughs> but anyways, uh, not with you though. I meant this show. But you can, but you can stay up to five so you can get my food too. But anyways, yes, here at Chunkles Cantina by um, Las Vegas Boulevard by Thunderbird. Come down and see us. We have full entertainment every Saturday, which is the singles night. It's one night stand. Are you gonna be here? Uh, no, this so, this Sunday, Saturday, 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 six to nine p.m. Come down and check it out. Yes. Uh, but anyways, I'm not done with you yet because you know what? As you can see, this man, you see that kind of moves that he's doing. He is actually a DJ at twenty-two point three Takeover Vegas, Vegas Radio. So tell us about how you get involved with that. Um, I got involved, me and um, the owner of the station, uh, Bagra Imani, um, we met one time when I was with another company and I think we were going south and we had made promises to each other, hey, this is what we're going to do. And I stuck it up, even though I wasn't with that company, I still had my end of the deal and we just talked. And she was you like, stand you know, on your word, that's a good right. word. And she was like, hey, you know, I appreciate that, but you don't got to do it. I said, no, that was my word, but I'm not a part of that anymore. Here's my part, I said, I do for you. But, you know, she accepted that in a good way and we just lied back there. And ever since then, there's no looking back. In fact, we made a pact together that says, what makes it fun? Because um, I was teasing the there, like, right now, we're like, two rockets. And they're both laying at the stars. And they're both going, oh, they're getting ready to take off. And once they go, it's only Yep, yep, 22.3 is coming. Oh, my God. It's big coming big time. And we have actually uh, uh, the Guinness. Guinness Book of World Records. Yes. 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 When is when is it? You're looking forward yeah, to that. Uh, he is one of the biggest uh, sponsor of the of that. Right, right. Um, yes, of that event and of 22.3. So, um, where they can actually find you uh, playing? Um, I play every Sunday from five to six. And you'll hear a genre of music. What type of songs do you play normally? What genre? Uh, um, I go by usually the mood that you know, kind of what I'm feeling with the area or where I'm at or what the whole world is going sometimes. And I'll play that genre. 
you know, I'll have like um, oldie but goodies for the OGs, and I'll have you know, you know, lit up lit up Sundays for the youngsters, for the young bloods out there. And I'll even have like Polly. I got guys from Fiji calling in playing music. Guys from Louisiana on the rap side that do it. I mean, it's just fun playing music that we can do it, and the owner gives us that ability that we can do it. Let me ask you a question. I know that your music is totally uh, totally um, opposite of the most favorite uh, genre that I want. is country songs. If I actually, let's say I'm a singer, and my songs are country music, can I tell you, hey, Manny, can you please uh, run my show? Yeah. I run my uh, songs? Yeah, I'll, I'll play it, but I'll listen to it first, and usually like I tell everybody, hey, you guys, I'll play anybody's music, if it tickles that ear, I don't care what genre it is, if it is, really? I'll play it. That's oh, amazing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Listen to this. I'm gonna put you on a spot right okay. on this spot right now. Okay. Uh, Mississippi Juke. Mississippi Juke. Move a little bit. It's going down right there. <laughs> Sink it down. All right, Mississippi Juke. This is uh. Hello, hello. This is Manny. How you doing, Manny? Good to meet you, brother. Manny C is a DJ of a radio station. Nice, nice brother. Yeah, and that's the cool. reason why I pull you here, because before I pull you here, I ask him, I already actually uh, screen him <laughs> about country music. So he likes country music? No. Um, I, I, it's not that I don't like it, I don't listen to it often, but these last couple of years I've been getting it, my family loves it. Well, I just my really stuff like is it. more Americana folk singer-songwriter. Okay. Um, like a cross between what you hear now, Leonard Skinner, and like storytelling, you know. Um, I consider myself more of a uh, storyteller than anything. My first album is actually called Storyteller because uh, the best compliment I ever had was from a 10 year old boy who told me that when he heard my song, Candle, which is a military tribute to the women at home lighting a candle, putting it in the window to let everybody know that they have a man that's overseas fighting, you know? So um, the last verse is like, so when you ride through my hometown, you see those candles burning down, you know there's a name behind every flame. It might not mean that much to you, but just a little respect is due because them flames burn from the red, the white, and the blue. You know, Perfect. so. Well, I'm gonna let you guys it, connect later. It, it, I just wanna introduce you guys close. together. It has its own, diff, you know, it has its Sorry, own yeah, style. Really so it's from the beginning that, to the end. It's not right. that somebody shot my dog, took my wife, kind of <laughs> country, you know And that's what I mean? country music is supposed to be. Thank you so much. Thanks, Maria. Thank like you. Great to meet you, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I put him on the spot. I love doing that, actually, by the way. <laughs> oh, yes, you do. <laughs> so, no, but that's how things happen. Yeah. Yes. I mean, you know, who knows? Who knows who you meet? We put them in there. We put them in there. We know we're going to hear them. Yes. We're in the 22.3 Take Over Vegas Radio. We're heard in 166 countries. Yes. Yes. You know, that's huge. Yes. You know, and, uh, you know, I am, uh, the, the good thing is I'm fully, I'm full support with uh, 22.3 and um, Imani, my good friend, actually full support of what I do too. And I love just the vibe of everything that we are doing. Uh, and then I met this guy right here who literally like, hey, Maria, and he tell you straight to your face if he doesn't like what you're doing or not. <laughs> so I am like, honey, don't talk to me like that. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But anyway, yeah, so uh, Power X drink, is, is it going to be on the shelves pretty soon? On the um, we're looking for distributors now. So you know now this this next season that's what we're coming up with. So that's why we're trying to get you know everybody trying the product. If you like it, say something good about it. That's all I ask. You know, yes, I yes. Cans, letting people try it and stuff. But um, like I said, honest opinion, man. I don't. Have to, I don't. I'm not scared because I know no, what's in not, my product. No, you're not. You're not. You're not know? scared. And I go. I go to bed against anybody. I don't <laughs> see know? that. I, see, I don't <laughs> see any that is, you know scary thing in your I mean, face. I, I just got it. I mean, it's just when you make a good product, the product does talking for itself, you know, and that's what we're planning on doing. You know, I don't want to be a, hey, Massey Power, no, 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 Power X. Power, Power X. Power X. Power X, Power yeah. X guys. That's Power right. X. So give, no. like, give us a follow. Yes, give us a follow. Power and X Dream. Yes, uh, you have Instagram. Yes, we do. You have Power website. X the website, the website. website is PowerXDreams.com. It's on Facebook. Do you have a Twitter, too? We have a Twitter account as well. 
Yeah, so they are all over the place. If you guys want to try it, you know, if you don't want to actually pay the whole pack, come and see us at, uh, well, he is here now in Vegas actually. So you guys can go to uh, 22.3 or you can go to our studio and you guys can try it for, you know, I probably gonna do a trade in with you. Either you get it for dollar fifty, or you can do a video for me drinking it. There you go. That's it. Yeah, yeah. That's for free. Money. Yeah, and I can Denver. give it you. Yeah, yeah. No, I can cool. give it to you for free. Yeah. Th those are the two choices, and it's really good, guys. It's very refreshing drink. And I seen some few of my hosts that are literally health. Uh, uh, you know, they are li really in looking on healthy things right. and they drink it and they were like, oh, I'm going to start drinking this. That's Shelly and Desi. Oh, cool. Yeah, they were Thank like, you, yeah, yeah. So she so got third show too, right? Yes. Rise yeah. and shine. Rise and shine. It's actually every Tuesday and Friday. I was trying to get them here, but you know, it's, they are so famous. They have a million of followers. And you know you cannot stop them of what the other things they're doing. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah. And also, don't forget on Friday, starting at noon time on our studio, we are doing a mini motorcade for one night stand Vegas style. Can we put you as a bachelor too? When? On Saturday. I just barely got invited. I want to see what's about. Let me come in and just. We have the pictures in the video. You never seen it yet? I've seen a little bit of it, but I mean, I just like you're to gonna. Check out the I'm gonna put you on stage. Please come. All right, I have one bachelorette. No, I shouldn't should do that because it's a secret for the bachelorette. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> no, you shouldn't. You shouldn't it know. Fun, but I just you know, I like what I like. Okay. Says, I said, you up, I'm like, you know what? I just, let's just be, be fine. Yeah, no, we, we're gonna we're going. gonna put we're gonna get you. I, I, we're gonna get. How about this? You're gonna be the next bachelor. Blindfolded the, the next one time, so you can ask, you can ask the question for the girl. Okay. All right, I like you that. are the next one. I like that. Whoa! So sign up now, guys, for the next bachelor. I speed dating or one night stand, Vegas time. Well, Manny, I really appreciate you so much. Thanks for having me. And, I really appreciate you. All. You know, uh, I'm so grateful to be your friend, and I am so grateful to know you actually, and to know our beautiful Imani out there. Shout out to you, Mr. Wow. Miss DJ Bad Girl. And uh, 22.3, take over Vegas. Radio. Yes, and 22. And we are doing the the Guinness record May on May 23rd. May 23rd. So stay tuned, you guys. Big shout out to our sister station too. <laughs> take over Miami Radio. Oh Just yeah. Just opened up May 1st, y'all. I make her nervous sometimes. I no, you don't. <laughs> You know, I think I'm making nervous. But anyways, thank you so much, Manny. Thank you so much, viewers. We have two more or three more guests coming up. So please stay tuned. Don't go away. Thank you for watching Let's Talk World. I hope you enjoyed our future guests for the day. Please visit us on socialmediashows.com, subscribe on our channel on YouTube, and follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Periscope. Don't forget to share and like and comment on our show. Thank you so much, and I'll see you guys again next week.